Nyman, how are you? Thanks for coming back to watch some mindfulness with me. Today we're actually going to do something a little bit different. We're actually going to do a Go Noodle. I know all of you love Go Noodle. I do too. I'm really excited to do it today. So today what we're talking about is unsticking emotions. So I want all of us to think in our minds before we start, are we happy? Are we sad? Are we mad? Are we frustrated? Are we worried? Are we scared? So I want you to think about how you're feeling inside right now. I'll give you a second to think about it. I'm feeling a little happy, but I'm a little tired today too. That's okay. So I'm really excited about this new stretch we get to do. So again, we're talking about unsticking our emotions. We don't have to be stuck being tired or sad or mad or any of those things that we don't wanna feel all day long, okay? So we're gonna do this stretch and hopefully you feel really happy afterwards, okay? It's called twist and turn. They're very simple stretches and I just want you to think about breathing the whole time. So we're thinking about how we're feeling inside. And we're also thinking about doing our inhale and our exhale, okay? So let's do three deep breaths together before we start, all right? We're going to inhale, inhale through your nose, and exhale through your mouth, okay? Let's do two more. Inhale, and exhale. Last one, inhale through your nose, and exhale through your mouth. Awesome job, Lion Cubs. Okay, you ready to get started? Great. Sometimes when we feel sad or mad or tired, we can get stuck in those feelings. But our bodies and our emotions are connected. So possibly twisting and turning and wringing out what's stuck can help get those emotions unstuck. Sit tall. You can be on the ground with your legs crossed or in your chair with your feet flat on the floor. And just for a moment, check in on your feelings. Are you feeling happy, blah, mad, sad, excited, worried, friendly, silly, lonely, or safe? Whatever you find is okay. Emotions are okay. But sometimes they can get stuck, especially the difficult ones. Maybe we can change that. Start by turning your head to the right. Turn slowly to look over your right shoulder. Remain there for three, two, one, and zero. And let your head return to center. Breathe. Now try turning your head to the left. Look to the side, then look behind your shoulder. Three, two, one, and zero. Return to the center, looking forward. Now we're going to add our shoulders to the turn. Go gently and slowly. Begin by placing your hands on the outside of your right leg. Your hands might help you to twist a bit more, but don't let them pull you too far. Turn your head to the right. Look over your shoulder. And now let your shoulders turn in the same direction you're looking. Only go as far as feels good to you. Keep breathing. Three, two, one, and zero. Slowly untwist. Notice how your body feels after going to the right. Just notice for you. Switch your hands to the outside of your left leg. Breathe in and breathe out as you get ready to turn to your left side. Turn your head first. Then twist your shoulders a little in the same direction. Go as slowly as you like. Keep breathing. Maybe stay for three, two, one, and zero. Untwist slowly. Rest your hands in your lap. Now once again, check in on your own emotions. Happy, blah, mad, sad, excited, worried, friendly, connected, silly, lonely, or safe. Emotions are okay, even the hard to handle ones. Sometimes 
twisting and turning can help stuck emotions get unstuck. Awesome, Line Cubs. You did an awesome job today. I hope however you were feeling before this, if you were mad or you were sad or you were kind of sleepy like Miss Nyman, now your emotion is unstuck and maybe you're happy now. Thanks for joining me today for Mindfulness with Miss Nyman. I'll see you soon, okay? Bye.